since the beginning. Trees have always been a very important part of making comfort and sustainability to the human being. In the future, that position will be strengthened. Showing that electrification of wood transport is possible, of course, that will put pressure on decision makers. And Scania have the ambitions and the ability to help us with the transition to electrified vehicles uh, in the harsh conditions where we operate. We need to take steps forward. The technical challenges we did see a few years ago do not longer exist. We can make this happen right now. It is really great to work with a large influential transport buyer like SEA, uh, not only because they share the same values as, as at Scania to prepare for a sustainable future, but also because together in this partnership we can really make this happen in terms of scale quickly. The uh, wood arrives by train from the inland and to get to its final destination at the Obola paper mill it will have to go 15 kilometers by truck and in the future with the electric truck. Charging infrastructure will be most essential, of course. And we need support from decision makers to make sure that we are preparing this infrastructure as soon as possible. We have the renewable wood sources, we have the renewable energy sources here in North Sweden, but we need to get the products to our customers in a sustainable way. Our R&D team at Scania are using the existing technology of our current vehicles, the electrical vehicles, but we are adding stronger components to the electric motor. We really need to be creative in terms of load, in terms of weight, in terms of distance when configuring this solution. But we're testing this right now to make sure that we can scale these type of solutions very quickly. And we can really drive the shift towards sustainable transport.